Make weep holes in each cell of each block. This can be done with a drill and a half inch masonry bit. Solid poured concrete walls have no cavities, so weep holes are not required. Prepare the surface properly. To properly bond and seal the system to the concrete floor, the floor area along the wall, approximately 3 inches wide, must be stripped to bare concrete. Remove all paint and tile adhesive. Lay out the baseboard. Place the sections of baseboard end to end along the wall between the corners. Use tint snips to cut the sections as needed. Apply adhesive. Turn the main sections of baseboard over and apply a heavy bead. Turn the baseboard over and set in place. Press gently. Do not press down hard. Caulk the floor joint. Caulk the floor joint with enough pressure to force some adhesive under the system. Seal connector joints. Apply a generous bead of adhesive over the corner joint. Apply adhesive to the seam connecting the two baseboards. Hook the connector at the bottom of the baseboard and snap it in place at the top. Using liquid soap with a little water works well to smooth out the adhesive. Apply adhesive across the bottom and up the wall and down the edge of the baseboard. Set end cap in place and caulk all edges again.